My name is Travis Sawe. I'm an assistant professor in the Faculty of Health Sciences at Simon Fraser University. I am a social epidemiologist, which means I try to understand how patterns of health vary across social groups. And the social group that I uh, research in particular are two-spirit, lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and queer, or 2S LGBTQ people. We know and we've known for some time now that 2S LGBTQ people experience a much higher burden of several definable mental health concerns. For example, depression, anxiety, substance use, struggling with unwanted substance use, and suicide. And uh, we are interested in understanding how are those patterns, those gaps in health changing over time and place? Are they getting better? If not, why aren't they getting better? The second component of that work is really trying to dig into some of those mechanisms or the, the means through which 2S LGBTQ people experience these disadvantages in health. And for this, we look at uh, the everyday social lives of 2S LGBTQ people. How are they treated by their family, their friends, by healthcare practitioners, by teachers and coaches, uh, religious leaders, et cetera. And we wanna understand if those interactions can either um, improve the health of 2S LGBTQ people, closing some of those gaps in, in, in mental health disparities, um, or unfortunately in some cases, are they contributing to um, poorer mental health? We should be proud that um, as of January of 2022, uh, conversion therapy is now a crime in Canada. Our, our, uh, our federal leaders have unequivocally shown us that these practices are incompatible with Canadian values. Um, but we still have a lot of work to do. Uh, we know that there's limits to how the criminal code can actually be enforced. And so I believe that the next set of work that we need to do, and all of us can do this, is really education in communities and schools and in, in our homes, um, really to let people know that whatever their sexuality whatever their gender identity, that they are loved, that they are good the way they are. Um, and I think that will take a lot more work uh, beyond just passing the bill. Um, but our team is prepared to do that work and we're really uh, grateful to have partners who, who are uh, supportive and, and in line with that goal.